Hello, what's up and welcome back to my channel or if you're new here, welcome. My name is Sherry. I love all things plus size fashion and I think I'm like the queen of Shein hauls. So if you like Shein hauls, what are you waiting for? Subscribe. I'd love to have you join us. Back at it again with another Shein haul for you guys today. I tried to pick out some like cool casual things, some things that I can wear now, but then also a few things getting me so excited for springtime. So if you're interested in seeing what I picked up, stay tuned. As always, big thank you and shout out to my friends at Shein for gifting me the pieces I'm going to show you today. I really appreciate it. I also have a coupon code. I will have the details of that along with everything that I'm trying on for you today in the description box below if you want to check any of these out for yourself and save a little extra cash. It's officially February, which means I am thinking spring. And so, like I said, I picked a few things that I know I can wear now into spring, but some really fun spring forward items that have got me so excited for warmer weather, more sunshine, later sunsets, you know the drill. So let's get into it. This is one of the pieces that I picked up that I thought was very season agnostic. It's just really fun. It's like a soft, cottony sweatshirt, kind of pullover style, really like casual in design. But then it's got this really fun sequin, like not sequin, um, rhinestone and silver chain fringe. It's giving like Western glam, Beyonce Renaissance era. How fun. It ends at the uh, arm here, so it doesn't go all the way around, which I actually like because you know if it did, those things would be caught on everything as you like sit on something with a back. Like, genius. But I will say like, I'm so OCD, so... <laughs> Just looking at this, like if these aren't just absolutely perfect, it's gonna drive me nuts. So if you're like me and you have to have things like very symmetrical and like perfect, this may not be the sweatshirt for you. But if you don't care, like this is so much fun. It's got movement, it's stretchy, like the body of this is just a nice comfortable sweatshirt. But the real winner here is the fringe embellishment. The thing I like about this too is I think you could wear it casually with denim like I have here, but you could also dress this up with like some trousers or something a little bit more formal if you had to because it definitely gives that flair. Next up we have this blouse. I was really drawn to this print and color story. It's giving me like kind of retro 70s vibes. It's a nice like burnt orange with blue like applique kind of design here. Really cute. I'd say it's cut very generous. I think I got this in the size 3X which is an 18. And as you can see, like, it's plenty roomy on me. So if you're in between sizes, I think you can size down and be just fine. I love, like, the billowy sleeve here with the cuff at the bottom. I think it just makes it look a little bit more elevated and tailored. So cute. I love this with denim. I also think this would look really cute with, like, some neutral colored trousers if you had to wear, like, this to, like, a work setting or a little bit more of a business casual type feel. Really cute, non-stretch, so pretty true to size or if you're in between sizes maybe size down and I think you'll be okay overall just a good you know basic button up that you just can't go wrong with I think it, this is also pretty seasonal agnostic check out this next piece this is really cool this is another like comfy casual pullover sweatshirt but I love the lilac color on this I think that the sweatshirt came in like four or five different color stories but I opted for like the lilac lavender because I love this juxtaposition with the color story of the print here but also as we head into spring like this is one of my favorite springtime pastels to wear I just think it looks so good it really brightens me up and so this was a no-brainer for me um but this is really cool it's got the starry night print here with Vincent from Vincent Van Gogh and it just has like the Van Gogh um, Museum of Modern Art 1889 the Starry Night like detailed here I think this is really cute it's definitely casual just like a throw over grab and go kind of style um, but fun fact like I love all things Van Gogh my dad passed away last year and he was an artist and if you have ever been in my home um, I have like five different Van Gogh replicas that he did um, and so I just love Van Gogh. I love it even more now that my dad's passed away. I just cherish it a lot more so when I saw this I was like yes like what a good way to like honor like an artist that I love, my dad and just the aesthetic and color story that I just I fell in love with Van Gogh when I saw this print so this is fun. This is really fun and if lavender is not your color comes in other colors so don't fret. Then we have this really fun open front blazer. This is really cute. It's very classic, but also nautical. Like if you know what I mean with the buttons, 
love this. It's black and white, super crisp and classic. It's like a stretchy kind of crepey fabric, not like a cottony fabric or like one of those traditional stiff blazer like fabrics. It has no lining, it's pretty thin and it just hangs open. There's no button closure, but it does have the faux buttons on the side as well as these faux pockets. Really stretchy and comfortable. If you're like me and sometimes you struggle with like the stretchiness in the back and in the arms, like this one is so very comfortable and it has the stretchability to really like move with you. So when you're in like a setting where you want to look a little bit more elevated but you don't want to feel stiff and stuffy, like what a great option. And this is just a classic black and white. You can't go wrong. This will go with just about everything. And then there's this really fun blazer. Check out the color and the print on this. This is definitely a statement piece. It is not your traditional blazer jacket, similar to the last one. This one is kind of like a thicker, almost like felt-like fabric, but it does have some stretch and give. It's not like super stretchy, but you can have some give in it. It's unlined, it's pretty like thin weighted, and it does have functioning buttons. So you can either leave this hung open or have a button shut like I have here. I prefer it to look a little bit more tailored. So I like the button aesthetic, but you have the flexibility. It has a really strong defined shoulder because there are these like shoulder pads in it too, which I like. It just creates a nice shape and silhouette. And ultimately I think this fits really, really nicely. It's tailored enough, but it get, has enough movement in it, like the fabric to where you don't feel stiff and stuffy. Love this, love this. These pockets are non-functioning too, by the way. But how fun is this? You could definitely wear this with some denim, but you could wear this in the workplace as well with like some trousers, some pleather leggings, like the world's your oyster, do you? This is just fun. And then we have this really fun swimsuit cover up. Look at the fringe and the movement on her. She is so fun. This is like giving me boho hippie chic. I love it. I have underneath of it just another Shein swimsuit that I have from last year. Um, but I think the color story kind of works with it as like a neutral, so I opted to wear that one. And this one doesn't have any stretch or give in it. It's kind of just like a hanging style. But I would say that this one fits me perfect at the size that I chose. It's got good movement. I love that this is a swimsuit cover-up, but you could absolutely wear this with like some jean cutoff shorts in the summertime. For again, like that boho kind of like festival look would be really cute. This is actually pretty decent quality. Like it's not going to like rip open, fall apart. Like I'm yanking on these strings and they're not tearing off. Is this gonna last you, you know, 10 years? Probably not, but things like this, like you really only get one or two seasons out of and you're good to go. But it's so fun. I love the little fringes at the bottom. They're probably gonna drive me crazy because similar to like the Beyonce rhinestone sweatshirt, I have OCD and if these aren't just perfect, I might lose it. But you know, that's just me. You guys, I didn't know that I was gonna love this as much as I do. Like the pictures online do not do this dress justice and this is super, super affordable. This is stunning. This is like so like fashion forward and just, oh, so sexy. I am obsessed. It's this like kind of bodycon style dress, but it does have some good give. And it's got like this disheveled nature to it. I love the tie dye kind of like dark, deep color tones. And then all of the fringe and like tears that are going on on this dress is like giving me like, I was on a cruise ship and our ship sunk and I had to find my way to shore and now this is what I look like. And I love it. I absolutely love it. It's disheveled, it's dirty, it's grungy, it's sexy, it's all of the right things. It's got this beautiful cowl neck up here, side slits on both sides of the leg, so you've got some good leg action. Now the dress itself is kind of sheer, so if you are a little insecure about having your undergarments show through, just know you'll want to wear a slip or something like that, or maybe some shapewear. Um, I'm not, I don't have any of it on right now, and I think it's absolutely stunning. Stunning. I can't wait to style this one. And last up is this really fun asymmetrical pleated dress. This is so good for like an upcoming trip or vacation. This is so lightweight and thin, and it will pack and wear so well if you're traveling. This is a must. Check it out. It is one shoulder. It's like a silky material. It's got pleats um, down the side here and a gathered ruched circle right here. I will say that the strap 
and the band on the bust is really, really thin. So if you were to wear any kind of strapless bra like I have on, I feel like it would show through. So maybe this is truly like, you just rock this braless and you'll be fine. But I love the sexy little cutout. And this is adjustable, so you can totally tailor the cinching to how tight or how loose you want it to be, which will create a larger or a smaller hole as well. I love the asymmetrical line on here. I think it's super flattering. This is a really nice silky material. It's got some good movement, it's pleated. Again, I think this is just going to travel and wear so well if you have an upcoming trip or anything. And the colors on this are just to die for. And that was everything that I picked up from this most recent Shein haul. I hope that you have enjoyed it. Like I said, I found some great things for now, but so many good things for springtime. It has me itching and so excited for warmer weather and sunshine. As always, I want to hear from you. What were some of your favorite looks? Is there anything that you're intrigued and wanting to try out for yourself? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget I do have a coupon code that you can use to save some cash at checkout. I'll have that in the description box below along with everything that I tried on if you want to check any of these out for yourself. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. That always lets me know what you enjoy here on my channel. And again, if you're not already a subscriber, come join us. We'd love to have you along for the ride. Thank you again so, so much. I always appreciate your guys' support and I will be sure to see you in the next video. Take care.